Hello and welcome to Birkanix Garage. I am Gilles and today I'm going to talk to you about the all-wheel drive system on the Audi S3 8V and how you can actually change some of the settings using Carista. So first I'm going to talk a bit about the drivetrain and how the all-wheel drive system works. So basically you know what kind of behavior we are going to change. And then second, I'm going to show you in Carista how you can do that change very quickly on your own vehicle. Okay, so as you know, the Audi S3 8V is an all-wheel drive system. It is not a Quattro system, it is a Oldex system. Even if some of the version have Quattro on it, even if in the US it is marketed at Audi S3 8V Quattro, Quattro system only from A4 upward at Audi. So what we have is the Oldex system. The Oldex system got a front wheel drive bias and it's actually quite a strong one. Essentially, to cut it short, it's basically until there is slipping, the back wheel don't really do anything. So, you know, you don't necessarily have the same all-wheel drive feel that you might have with other different systems where, you know, they might have a front-wheel drive bias, but you still get 30, 40, 50% at the rear. Well, not 50%, but you see what I mean. <laughs> so, this setting basically allow you to tell the old deck system in your car that by default send a bit more power to the rear too, which means you've got a more all-wheel drive feel in normal driving condition when driving your car. Okay, so now let's see how we can do that change in Carista. First thing first, plug your Carista dongle in your OBD2 port, put ignition on and connect your app. Once you're connected to your app, I'm just going to put your screenshot, you basically Go in the drivetrain setting. At the bottom, you've got the Oldex, Old W drive system. And then you can enter that and you will have your three options. You've got your standard, you've got your more at the rear, and you've got your reduced noise. You select one and then you need to check. You've got a little slider at the bottom. You need to click that too. It's basically a warning telling you that obviously you're changing a setting that is affecting the drivetrain of your car so that you're aware of the risk involved in doing so. Plenty of people have done that setting. I haven't seen anybody reporting any issue. It's pretty safe, but obviously Carista, the software, they kind of want to take responsibility and say, okay, here you're changing this. It is your own responsibility if the car behavior change. Kind of makes sense. And then you click save. And that's it. Pretty much, you know, another quick video, guys. I mean, if you want more Carista tweaks, go check the Audi S3 8V playlist. There is plenty of there at the minute. We also do plenty of other mods. At the moment, I'm in between houses and I've got too many projects and very little room to work. So this is why at the moment we are very much focused on software tweaks, uh, but we do also have plenty of them on the other modes and uh, yeah, a bonnet exit coming very soon. Just got delayed a little bit because of, uh, you know, the old COVID. Uh, but yeah, that's it for this one, guys. Subscribe for more comments, go check the playlist, give us a like, give us a comment. Have you used that setting? I know it's available on other MQB platform. If you have, let us know what you think of it. And uh, see you in the next one, guys. Bye-bye.